Okay, unfortunately, if you don't know the, um, the dot product and how it works, then you cannot just like figure this out by sketching. Okay, I don't think. Maybe you can. Yeah, you can. This one's just confusing because they don't give you numbers. So V, excuse me, V is negative 1 comma 1 and W is 1 comma 1. Do you guys agree? So hey, look guys, just do this. I mean, come on. You're the ones that taught me how to do this. If it's left 1 up 1, you don't even need a calculator for this. Right? What angle is this? Yeah, 45. And if it's right 1 up 1, what angle is this? So then what's the angle left? 90. So the answer is yes. But let me tell you this. The dot product between these two things, you remember that the dot product is a compatibility vector. So if you dot these things and the answer is 0, that means they literally have nothing in common. This one here is going north and uh, east, and this one's going north and west, and they're, they don't really have anything in common. Or like, if you pulled, well, I shouldn't say that. It would do things, but they're not going in the same direction. And notice that V dot W is zero. See that? So think about what you did from my previous little equation. You do cosine of theta is 0 over, I think this would be radical 2 on the bottom, but don't worry about that. If cosine is 0, then theta has to be 90. That's, that's how that works. Boom.